What's up guys, iApple Tewer here and today I have a great news for you guys. The iPhone 5s, iPhone 6, 6 Plus, iPad mini and iPad Air and also not to forget iPod Touch 6th generation is added for the jailbreak. So now they are all compatible for the jailbreak, yellow jailbreak, iOS 10.2. So that's why I'm just making this video just to let you guys know about the jailbreak, about the new beta 6 and actually how to jailbreak those devices which are support and for the sake of this video guys I'm going to actually jailbreak my iPad Air this time and if you're wondering why I'm not jailbreaking this device is because this is the iPhone 7 plus and the support is not yet added which I do hope gets supported but unfortunately as of right now the iPhone 7 is still not supported but now all you need to do is just get your device get your charging cable and get your computer and follow this video okay guys now what all you want to do is just go ahead and connect your device okay guys just to show you guys that this is actually ios 10.2 let's go to settings general about and here as you can see guys it is the ios 10.2 so now that you have connected everything's ready get onto your computer and follow the video okay guys now that you're onto your computer first thing first is just to make sure that you have itunes on your device this does work on mac and windows next there's a link in the description that you guys want to go ahead and click it will take you here it just says in the description yalu jailbreak so first thing first in the description there's also a link for cd impactor so make sure that you have cd impactor onto your device the latest version of cd impactor is the one you need so mac or windows click on it and once you do that it will go ahead and start to install i already have it so i'm going to go ahead and cancel it next as i already mentioned there's a link which says yalu jailbreak once you go there guys it says beta 6 supports all devices except iPhone 7, iPad Air 2, and iPad Mini 4. So these devices are the ones which are still not supported, which I do hope gets supported. But now all you want to do is just click on IPA CDI Impactor. So you click on that, it will go ahead and start to install the IPA. I already have it, so I'm going to also go ahead and cast. Okay guys, so as you can see here is the Impactor and YALU 10.2 jailbreak. If the Impactor is in a zip folder, all you need is just WinRAR. WinRAR free version for Windows will be in the description to you guys to install. And then you want to extract and it's as simple as it will get to this. It will get to this folder. So now let's go ahead and open the folder. Click on Impacted EXE. Keep it in the folder. Go ahead and minimize this. Here is the Impactor. Now all you want to do guys is as simple as this. Just get this YALU 10.2 IPA file drag and drop it right here once you do that you want to enter your valid apple id so let me go ahead and enter that with the password okay guys now that you have entered your password and apple id this will pop up apple developer warning you want to click on ok so once that is done now all you want to do is just make sure that installing so i can see signing ipa Okay guys, so as you can see, YALU 10.2 jailbreak is just onto your device. You want to click on it says untrusted enterprise developer or just untrusted developers. You want to go to your set, go to general, scroll down to profile and device management or just device management. And then you want to click on your developer app, click on it, click on trust, trust. So now that is trusted. So you want to go back to the YALU 10.2, click on it, and then this will open up and it will say, click on okay. And it will say just a go button. And it's as simple as this guys. Now all you want to do is just click on go. And you just may need to try this one or two times again if this doesn't work by the first time. If it does work the first time, then you're lucky. If it doesn't, you just need to do it one more or two times and then it will finally work and you will have CD on your device. Just to show you guys, if this pops on your device, you want to click on done. And now just wait for it to restart your device and let's see if it actually gets CD in the first try or not. So actually, the CD did install with the first try or not. So go back to the last screen, as you can see guys, Cydia is onto our device. So click on Cydia, let's see if it opens or crashes. And there you go guys, as you can see, Cydia is working perfectly fine without any issues, the changes, everything is working fine. I'm so glad that this did work with the first try. And there you go guys, as you can see, the beta 6 of the iOS 10.2 jailbreak is working successfully on my iPad Air without any issues. So I hope that you guys did enjoy this video. If you did guys, please drop a thumbs up for the video. Also, don't forget to share this video with your friends and family. And also don't forget to subscribe if you yet haven't done so. And just so you guys know, if you're on iOS 10.2.1 and if you want to jailbreak your device, if it is compatible, all you want to do is just watch the video either at the end of this video where there's an annotation or there's a link in the description to show you guys how to downgrade your iOS 10.2.1 to iOS 10.2 and then jailbreak. So I hope that you guys did enjoy it. Have a great day, guys. Enjoy your jailbreak. See you guys very soon with much more videos. iApple Tuber here, signing off.